AJ Squad. Welcome back to episode of Is It Worth It? So today's episode, we got this cool image right here and basically what this is, is a pet water fountain. If you can see for the one that we got right here from this brand, and right here is basically what the plot looks like when you guys first get it. And if you see inside right here, they do mention how it does have a two liter capacity that's on here. So this part is mainly designed for a small pet, and not so much for a big pet, even though you do have the option available. And if you guys turn it to the side right here, they do probably got some of the specs and features that's on the product. So they mentioned how the product is quiet. It has five stages of filtering. It has two flow design. It's BPA free. It has the LED light option. And it has a large capacity that allows you guys to see the water level inside. So that way you guys know when it's low. But here is basically what the package looks like when you guys first get in. Let me actually open up to show you guys what the inside looks like first. So once you guys open up, here is basically what the inside looks like. So first thing inside right here, they do probably got a user manual to teach you guys how to set it up and how to use it. Next thing inside right here, they do probably got a brush that you can use to clean the product. Inside they do probably got some backup filters that you can use to replace it once it's done using it. So there's three right here and one in the product. And then last but not least, we do have the pot right here. So take out the wrapper first. So once you guys take it out, here is basically what the pot looks like. So in the front part right here, you see we do have the brand logo. And then right here, we do have the clear view so that we can see the water level inside. Bottom part, they do have like the non-slip material, so that way the product won't move around when you guys do use it. And throughout the product on the side, they do have like a plastic material, if it's in here. And then right here is basically what the top part looks like. So you see there's two different options on here. One of them is where the water will go back in, and the other one is where the water will come out. And I'll show you guys what I mean in a second. But for this part right here, you do have the option to take it out. And that is basically what the inside looks like. So right here is basically where you guys want to take this part out to put the filter inside to filter the water for your pen. And then right here is where the water will come up. So right here in the inside, they do probably have another filter, which is the fourth one. And then right here is basically what the inside looks like. And if you guys open this part right here, they do probably have everything else inside. So right here, we do have the dispenser option that you can put on top. So that will get like an umbrella effect when the water comes out, which I'll show you guys in a second. And the last thing inside is this part right here. So this side, we do have the USB option for the plug-in cable to actually activate it. And this part right here is where you can put it inside. So the bottom part, we do have the suction cup option to hold it in place. Right here, we do have like a filter option. And right here, I'm assuming is where the water will be dispensed out. So you probably want to put it like this. And then for our side right here, you basically want to put it inside like this. So just like that. So you definitely have the option to use this or you can take it out. And just use like that if you guys want to. So I've been seeing for the product, there's a lot of different filtering options. There's the one you put inside right here, and there's one inside right here. So that way your pet have clean water drink each time. But now let's put everything together to show you guys how to assemble it. So you guys want to take off this part right here first. And you basically want to put this inside onto right here. They do have a spot for you guys to put it inside. So let's go like this. Make sure it fits in there just right. And then for the cable, you basically want to put it inside right here. Slide it all the way until it comes out this way. So just like that inside. Once you guys got that set up, you guys can put this on top. So just like that. But before you guys do put this inside, you want to take out one of the filters to put it inside. So you want to open this part here. And you want to take out one of the filters. And the filter you guys to put it inside like this. And then close it back up. So just like that. Once you guys do that, now you can put it back inside. So that way, not only does this dispense water, but also help you guys filter the water as well, which is pretty nice. And like I mentioned, you do have the option to use this to put on top, or you can just use it without it. So now I'm actually going to add some water inside, and then we'll test it out to show you guys what the product looks like when you guys do use it. And then we'll come back and talk more product in a second. All right, so right here, we do have the product. First thing I do is to add the water inside first. So this is probably like the max line in terms of how much it's in hand. All right, so that should be good. Now let's put that on the lid. And now let's plug it in to show you guys what the product looks like when you do use it. All right, so let's do plug it in. Here is basically what the product looks like when you guys use it like this. So this is the first option available. If you guys want to put on this option, you do have the option available. Let me show you what I mean. So we just stick it in. This is basically what the product looks like if you guys use this option right here, which is basically an umbrella option. So pretty much the water comes out right here, and the water goes back in right here, and basically filter the water inside right here and the bottom part as well. So it's very easy and very simple for you to set it up. And right here on the side of the product, you can see it does show you guys at the water level of where it's at. But here is basically what the product looks like once you guys do set it up. And you see it definitely does work. So now let's test this out with our pet to show you guys what the product looks like. So right here we do have the pet feeder and the pet water fountain. So we have to test it out. So I see the product definitely does work. 
Welcome back guys. So nice so quick test of product and definitely actually does work and should work quite well. So you see once you guys add the water inside and plug it in, it actually works pretty well. So whether if you guys want to use it for a dog or a cat, however you guys want to use it, that is totally up to you guys. But like I mentioned earlier, the way how to design this product is meant for like small pets. But if you guys do want to use it for a big pet, you do have the option available. And I do love the way how they design the product because they do have the clear view design in the front. So that you can see like the water level inside and know when to add more water if you guys do need to. But that is basically everything that's on the product. Now the unboxing and testing product. Now to answer the question of whether or not that's worth or not. So for this product, I do have to say that it is pretty worth it if you guys want to leave one of these. Especially if you guys are in the market looking for a high quality pet water fountain. Where it basically dispenses the water and also help you guys filter the water as well. Then I do have to say that it is pretty worth it. But then obviously for those guys who don't want or don't want or have one of these, then obviously don't buy one and save your money for something else that you actually do need. So that's basically everything for this video itself. If you guys like this video, make sure to smash that like button in the bottom. That will definitely help this video out. And it will definitely help with the algorithm as well to promote more videos for you guys so you guys can see more of the videos or similar videos as well. But as always, make sure to stay positive, be you, and I'll see you guys in the next episode of Is It Worth It? Peace.